What's going on YouTube? You're chilling with Bulk Me Up and we are back for another part of Let's Play Bravely Default Blind. Um, I have done these episodes kind of back to back, I think three in a row now, but I'm going to stop after this so that way uh, I can still read your guys' comments and stuff. But anyway, we got a party chat, so let's go ahead and read it. Ain't that the truth? The proprietress, the proprietress put on a brave face, but we make now for the duchy, enemy territory. Right, it's going to be dangerous. Dats, Zats, it's best if you two took the proprietress and left the ship. Though it kills me to say, farewell to our cooking. No more desserts. It can't be helped, you two. Besides, these two have their mission as shield bearers. Huh? Mission? All right. Hey, don't worry about that. Our current orders are to escort the vessel of the wind, of wind and keep her safe. What? Since when? Since you guys helped us out. The orders came from Commander Goodman himself. That's why the two of us b both came to Grand Ship to, to tip a few back. The old house is full of new shield bearers who came to take uh, over for us. Then I guess that just leaves the proprietress. We'll have to convince her to, s to take shelter. Yeah, good luck with that. Maybe when Mount Car... Karka? Oh, that's the mountain that we were... That was over there. Okay. Hey, when Mount Karka freezes over. You'll be lucky if she doesn't beat you for asking. I'm Grand Ship born and raised. If you don't like it, get the heck off my boat. <laughs> Too perfect. That's her answer guaranteed. An uncanny, an uncanny likeness. I think I'm getting Idea and Zats a little too mixed together. I'm going to try and distinguish those two more. Still, the danger is too great. It's for her own sake that we ask. Look, my bet is seeing you all stirred something inside her. In spite her. Besides, you really think you can live without her cooking now that you've had it? A fate grimmer than a thousand deaths. Ain't that the truth? All right, yeah, I'm getting it mixed up. Ain't that the truth? Tee hee. Tee hee, jeez. <laughs> You're not bad yourself. Look, you leave her to us. Between the three of us, we'll keep this boat safe when you're away, no matter what. Then you have my thank. Then you have my thanks. That's that's. Think nothing of it. You just need to, you just need to rest and leave this crate to us. And more party chat. Okay. The ice of Eternia. Whoa! This is amazing. Look how high up we are. I could gaze upon every woman in the world at once from Grand Ship's deck. Oh, great ring a bell. I'm coming, my sweets. There's not one of you more than ten minutes away from me now. Jesus Christ, ring a bell. The long wait is over. Yours is a one-track mind. And that track isn't even a good one. Still, it's weird coming home after so long. Eternia, land of immortality. It's cold there year-round, right? Right. And I'm not kidding when I say cold. Bundle up, everybody. Idea, what, um, what is snow like? I fear I've never seen it before. Well, for once, well, for one, it's at the top of my whitest snow list. <laughs> All right. It's like fluffy, it's like white fluffy crystals raining from the sky. I see. That sounds quite romantic, actually. It's like bits of cotton candy falling from the heavens. It still it melts it still melts on your tongue. It's not but it's salty, not sweet. Is is that so? It does start as evaporated seawater after all. Ah, of course. And the sea is certainly salty. And that's not all. Sometimes when it snows, fish fall from the fish fall from the sky. Fish? Really? <laughs> Don't tease the poor girl, ring a bell, be nice. You were deceiving me? <laughs> yes, what the hell? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't pipe up sooner. If you still have questions, I'll give you real answers. Honestly, Adia. So what color is snow really? It's wh it's white. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, that was fun. Uh, do I need a rest at all? Uh, Adia needs some healing, but other than that, I'm pretty good. Anius could use some MP. Jesus. Uh, where's my magic? Uh, 
Pia, or Anyus can just use Cura. Yeah, that did it. I need to replenish her MP anyway. Here's my, uh, Ethers. Yeah, I've got 17. I can afford to use one. And I'll just use Ethers for the rest of it. There we go. Ooh, everyone else leveled up so they got a little less HP. That irks me. That irks me just a little bit. Uh, one cure should do it. Just fine. There we go. Everyone's at full. Nice and full. Okay, now let's go ahead and get to, uh, Eternia, I guess. Man, this is real- <laughs> Look at this! I'm sailing over the mountains! I'm gonna go over Starkward. I'm going backwards and it looks like I'm looking fo going forward. <laughs> I don't know why I find this so damn entertaining. <laughs> Aw, I can't go over this. Or that, that, this is Starkboard. The other one was something else. I wish I could find a way to go over this. That'd be fun. <laughs> Especially funny. I wonder if I can go on. Oh, oh, can I go over the volcano? I can go over a volcano. Uh, can't go over the town. Yep, I can go over the volcano! Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> this is awesome! Alright, let's see where else we can go. Oh, I need to go to, uh, okay, enough fooling around. I need to go to the thing. Can I get off here? Oh, water. Okay, that's how I get off there. Okay, and over that, I need to go over here. It looks like there's something, it looks like there's beach over here I could land. Ah, uh, whatever. Ah, uh, well, let's head straight for the destination then, shall we? Oh? Cutscene? Yep, we got a cutscene. Lord Marshal, we've just received word that Grandship has vanished. Vanished? Vanished? You mean to say it has sunk? We know little as yet. But it seems Grandship's inhabitants have evacuated on Moss. And according to what we have heard from them, Grandship did not sink, it simply vanished. How is such a thing possible? Alternus, where is the Wind Vestal now? After a brief stop in the Kingdom of Calvisla, she entered Grandship before it vanished. Her current whereabouts are unknown. Muster our forces with haste. I will have every last soldier be made ready for war! For war? Yes, your lordship. But may I be so bold as to ask why? Our land of Eternia is an inviolable realm of rings with lofty highlands. Sure, even one such as the Wind Vestal could not. It is my hope I make much of naught. Yet we cannot leave matters to hope or chance. For we now have but one crystal under our control. Could it be your lordship's daughter is providing the Vestal with information about our defenses? That's certainly possible. Victor, hold your tongue. No, his fear is not without merit. Seems like I can get I, I can get off here. But I don't want to get off here. Huh. Alright. Well, I can still get off here. Why, not, why can't I get off here? It looks like I can land here. Alright. What's all this? Oh, looks like I could land here. Let's do that. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! What the fuck? Um, alright. Makes sense. I guess they're just not having any of that shit. I tried. What is all this anyway? Ooh! Looks like some kind of villa here. That's pretty cool. I can get off here. Well, could I get off here? Oh, nope. Same thing. Okay, well, they're not having any of this shit either. Okay, yeah, skip. I get it, they're not gonna let me down here. Alright, well... 
Oh. What's this? It looks like a village, but I don't think I can get out there. Let's see where this leads. Seems like some kind of route. Oh! It leaves right from this village. Alright, it seems like I'm not going to be able to get off any... It seems like they're not going to let me get off anywhere but here, so let's just go ahead. I bring ill tidings. An enormous flying vessel has been sighted over Southmore, and it appears poised to alight there. Ill tidings? I fail to see how such a vague report is anything of the sort. S suffice to say, sir, it's a veritable fortress, far beyond the size of an airship. Could it be? Lord Marshal? This is the Wind Vestal's doing. Do you mean to suggest Grand Ship has taken flight? That it has surmounted the highlands that defend our land? How absurd. Spare me your flights of fancy. Hey, now who should hold their tongue? Actually, you know what? You, you should still hold your tongue. How do our defenses presently stand? Hmm. They stand ready for war, as your lordship commanded. And our troops in Frost Peak Passage, and artillery as the summit, are prepared to engage at any moment. Which I wish I knew about that artillery. We shall join the defense effort. Victor. Is the demon child ready for war? I beg you, call her not a demon child. That is, if you hold your life dear. <clears throat> and whether Victoria goes to war is not for either of us to decide. The decision is hers alone. But is she not receiving treatment as we speak? When she worked her magic upon me, she seemed more than ready for battle. Her fits grow in frequency of late. Is she not nearing her limit? There is no cause for alarm. None whatsoever. Alright. Oh, we're gonna have to deal with Victor and Victoria. Ooh, chapter four, black and white. Black and white magic? Victor and Victoria! I get it! Crystal lies in Everlast Tower. Isn't it in some manner of temple? There are no crystal temples in the Duchy of Eternia. Fifteen years have passed since they stamped out the crystal orthodoxy in this land and remade the Temple of Earth into Everlast Tower. Huh. We must reach the city before we can get to the tower. And that means a trip through Frost Peak Passage. All right. The army has special defensive units stationed there to prevent any intruders. It will be a fierce fight. So I suggest we prepare before setting out. Yes, and Zat. I want you to take the proprietress and flee in the ship if the worst comes to worst. Understood. You can count on us. They don't seem too uh, against that kind of plan, you know, going it alone. Or having us go it alone, having them uh, be in safety, all that good stuff. What the fuck is that? Looks like a giant ice golem. I think I just answered my own question, but jeez, what the fuck? Alright. Uh, I think this is Frost Peak Passage or whatever. Um, I'm assuming I'm going to have to fight that thing, so let me just see if everyone's good. I mean, they should be. Uh, yeah, I guess. Well, let's go. Although this is a little annoying, this is a little annoying that goes like th that it goes around like this. Uh, I don't want to. Thing looks giant, massive, and I don't wanna. Oh, ability! Before I forget, uh, up here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Uh, healing warp. Got to remove something first. There we go. Alright. Let's do this! That is a giant-ass golem. Alright, well, let's go ahead and set up for... Whatever. I'm gonna need to examine this thing. 
And ring a bell. The usual, please. Uh, catch me and... Ninjutsu. Jutsu Semi. Become the target for physical attacks and instantly dodge them. Love it. Uh-oh. Ha-ha! Ha! Wow! That's not as much HP. Weak to fire! Okay, good. In our family, inorganic. That's kind of odd. Oh, if it's weak to fire, I should uh, equip the Flame Tongue. It wasn't too much more powerful than the Cross Axe, so that should be fine. Yeah, it's just like one point uh, difference for defense. Uh, in case Tiz has to attack. I don't think he will, just because um, I need to... Uh, I I'm going to be having... Ah, you get what I mean. I think you get what I mean, anyway. Uh, everyone else, guard and ring a bell. Same kind of deal, Utsusemi, and where is my item? Steve Snipe, use. Maybe I can get maybe I can get this thing's item beforehand, so I won't have to worry about it. Damn it! Well, now I'm gonna have to wait. Haha. -ha. Okay, let's see what else we got. Uh, guard, guard, guard. I guess I can just do auto for ring a bell since it's gonna be the same thing. Damn it! Still nothing. What the? Whoa! Okay. Um. That was damage. <laughs> Alright, now let's see how much the Blessed Shield cures after that. That should, It should cure more. Uh, Dia. Nothing ventured. And... Judgment. I mean, I shouldn't need to use Nothing Ventured, but I, I want to keep something, just in case. Oh! Wait, 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 wait. I don't have to do Nothing Ventured. I can do, I can do a setup thing. Uh, Spirit Barrier. MP goes down instead of HP. And now I can... Uh, judgment. Okay. He's weak to fire, so let's go ahead and set this up. Uh, weak an enemy. Eh, let's just go with the Shakwa... Uh, what is it? Shakwa Arrow. Yeah, let's go with that. And go ahead and set up for fire! Burn, bitch, burn! <laughs> I feel weird. Okay, I think I still need my Utsusemi. I still need it, okay. Man, I'm gonna be using this constantly. It's a good thing it doesn't cost MP. Not singing. Where's the knife? There it is. Alright, go for it. Yes! Perma crystal. All right, let's see if it has anything else after this. Oh damn it! I forgot that thing has water helmet. Fuck. All right, well she's gonna be doing the same amount of damage she's dishing out, I guess. All right, well this will have to make up for what she did. Completely forgot I called it shock arrow because I, uh, because it does damage. Ah, never mind. Yes, Spirit Barrier. And Judgment! Alright, Tiz, I'm gonna need you to make up for some of her mistake. Where's, uh, Stomp, 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 and Shield Strike. Guard, Guard, go. Freezing Punch. Ooh! Yes, weak point. Alright, where's my items? Guard, guard, and ring a bell. Do you still have it's to send me up? But you do not have follow me up, okay. Or catch me. I keep calling it follow me, but it's catch me. Alright. Come on, you big ass freaking golem. Target me. Oh! Oh, he doesn't have any more items! I can go, I can go for my- I can uh, do my thing. I can equip a good item. Or good weapon. Yeah, there we go. That healing lore really helps. Okay. Now I can go ahead and equip... What did I have before? Glaive, Trident, Lubu's Spear. Lubu's Spear is still the strongest. I don't think I have anything else with fire, though. 
Alright, and it looks like a Dia is going to attack next turn. Do I still have Catch Me? I don't have a Utusemi, though. But a Dia is going to attack next turn, so I'm going to go ahead and Brave Up. Ooh, Overpower. Crit Rate or Physical Attack. Let's go with Physical Attack. And where is my Utsusemi? There we go. Alright, bring it on. Nice! And dodge. Nope! Haha! <laughs> Guard. Ooh, I can special with Adia too. Moonshadow and. Judgment. Agnes, go ahead and fire this bitch. Ring a bell. You're gonna need it to send me again, but this time you can actually attack! Wow, that's a lot! Uh oh. Uh oh! Adia's MP just dropped like a rock! Okay. Everyone needs healing. Say goodbye. Let's see how you like this, bitch. Oh, nine, 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 nine. Love it. And judgment. And it's gone. Awesome. <laughs> not bad. Not bad at all, guys. Took care of that golem without any kind of problem. Except for a giant MP and... Except for a giant MP loss, basically. Uh, but for now... Hanyas, please, for God's sake, heal everyone. Avast everyone... Virus database has been updated. Thank you, Avast. Thank you. You've been so damn quiet during this whole time I've been recording. And now... Now you decide to speak up. Thank you so much for the update. You have no idea how much I appreciate it. If any of you can't tell, I'm being so sarcastic, it hurts! Ah. Uh, wow, Cura doesn't cure as much as I'd like it to. Man, that just... All of Adia's MP went. Alright. Well, that's it for this episode, I guess. Um, Next time, I guess we'll continue forward. But until then... Uh... Tell me what you guys think about the series so far. Just, like... Ah, oh, jeez. I, I don't know what I'm trying to say. This has been really fun. We find... I mean, like, just Grand Ship rises out of the water. That is freaking cool. And not only that, but we managed to take on that Ice Golem. It looked like it'd be really threatening at first, but I guess... You know what? Utsusemi plus... Well, just Utsusemi is just so damn powerful. Uh, anyway, I hope you guys all enjoyed that. If you did, be sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the playlist, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!